EO was cracking, guys. You read that title correctly. We're doing the second half of Tammy having a heated encounter with her new therapist. That's how it's supposed to go. Oh, this person wants to help me? I, I'm fucking pissed. She's literally at this therapist meeting as if she doesn't need a therapist. Apparently she lost all the weight. Somebody sent me a picture of her now. Still looks like shit. Gonna be real with you. Didn't help at all. Should have stayed like this. <laughs> uh, if you've never seen me before. Hi, read the bio or the about for this channel. Go for it. That's what it's about. Yesterday was pretty good. I like the anger she has. Like therapist rooms are small. And there is two cameras, a producer, Tammy, who is six people, and the therapist. Let's see how the second half goes. My goals for Tammy is for her to accept, validate, acknowledge her reasons for eating more than what she should. She knows the reasons. Uh, delicious food is awesome, and she just constantly wants that mouth orgasm. She obviously has a problem with delaying gratification and just wants that instant dopamine hit. Glad I could figure that out for you. She's like, ah, oh, she had to have been abused. I think she's just all fat, like her whole family, the whole family tree. The only time they weren't fat is when it was cool to be fat in the medieval times. But she's afraid to tell me. She's afraid to tell herself the reasons. But you've been in therapy before, right? Okay. Did you find therapy to be helpful the last time you were in? Does it sound like she found therapy helpful? You know, this is really making a bad case for making people go see therapists. This chick sucks. Okay. How come? Mm -hmm. I mean, technically, the last therapy appointment I had was with my sister. Mm -hmm. We butt heads, so mm -hmm. it was just... I, I shut down. So, how is she going to... Hold the baby and walk at the same time. That's a very good question. You're not stable enough. Don't sit there and make me out to be the bad I'm guy. I'm not the bad guy. I'm just trying to say. Whatever. Why is this like two children who just got in trouble talking to their mother? You're not going to get grounded. Don't make me look like the bad guy in front of mom. She's there to help. Not to judge, even though she is. Sometimes you are. This is why. Shut down and stop talking. Okay. Do you tend to do that often, Tammy, shutting down? Yeah. Okay. To me, it's my way of not fighting or yeah. whatever. Yeah. Okay. okay. Wow. Well, then maybe you should just shut down forever. Yeah, close the fucking mouth. I hate hearing you talk. I don't think I've ever heard her say one good thing. Like, not even a thing less than bad. Never had a good take. Tammy... In general, how is your mood? Fucking dandy. What do you think? <laughs> Look at her. If I was to put on five pounds, I'd be depressed. Imagine how she's feeling. She's also, she also hates being there. You're giving her help and she's angry. You think the rest of the day she's just like, wow, this is great. Oh, I love life in this wheelchair. I'm not trying to stay positive. And okay. Only when I'm not feeling good or yeah. hurting real bad is gotcha. when, okay. when I start getting snappy. Okay. How about becoming easily annoyed or irritable? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's crazy that you can look like that and still have a bad personality. Pick one. Good looking and an asshole or looking like a bag of laundry and acting like one. You're supposed to be jolly like Santa Claus. How are you gonna get annoyed and snappy at people when they could just turn you around and roll you down a hill? Why are you laughing? <laughs> That's good. Because it's true? <laughs> Probably. Okay. So, what are some weaknesses? Some things that you can kind of work on? Walking, breathing. Oh, and eating. Eating, I would like to do more of that. Is there a way I could eat more food and lose weight. I just watched a YouTube video yesterday about people who sat in chairs for so long that they morphed into the chair. Tammy. Confidence. Confidence. Do you struggle a lot with that? Better fucking struggle with confidence. If you were a confident person, I'd kill myself. Not one thing to be confident about. She can't even fall back on like, at least I have a good personality. She's probably not even a fast eater. She couldn't win an eating contest. Yeah, okay. 
Are you nervous that people are going to judge you? And Oh, yeah. Okay. I do anyways. I mean, I, I do care what people think, but then, then again, I really don't. At the end of the day, it's, what matters is what I think and my boyfriend, so. Okay. That's a great attitude, but sometimes it's harder to, to kind of practice Believe that, it. right? Yes. Yeah. Excellent. Okay. Yeah, that's an easy thing to say that you do. She doesn't do that. Also, even if tomorrow you look like America's Next Top Model, people will still judge you. It's called being a person. You could always say, I don't judge a book by its cover, but it just happens, you know? If you've never seen me before and you see me walk up and I have head tattoos and neck tattoos, you're going to have some thoughts that you didn't think you were going to have. Like, you're going to be like, this guy's probably racist. And then you're going to go, wow, I was right. Well, maybe I should start judging people. <laughs> Okay. That's what I'm working on is believing. Okay. That, you know, I am cuter. I am prettier. Yeah. So I'm going to keep it a buck. Never going to happen. Not possible. Not pretty. <laughs> anyway. What was that Jordan Peterson post? Didn't he share like a picture of a fat model? He's like, sorry, nope, not beautiful. <laughs> Like, even if she lost all the weight, she has an ugly face oh, and personality. That was about as dumb as me going, I believe I have a full head of hair. Just believe in it. Okay, believing in yourself, yeah. That's really hard work, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's really hard to think you're pretty, isn't it? Because I'm really struggling. It's that you're hurting my eyes. What is your goal? To get down to 550, so I'm going to weight loss surgery. Okay. Is that something that you think you could probably do it? Or are you like, gosh, that's a huge mountain. I'm not sure I could climb. Well, when you put it that way, I don't want to climb anything. I can do it. You can do it? Okay. Um, I'm not hearing a lot of confidence in that. <laughs> uh, Tammy, what are your thoughts about the session thus far? Well, you've asked six questions and they've all gone poorly. I really want Tammy to be like, honestly, you're kind of a cunt. I hate that you're smaller and smarter than me. I am debating eating you. <laughs> okay, I don't know what that means, so you're going to have to verbalize it. Okay, there's no thoughts about the things that we talked about today. Okay. I never want to, um... See you again, ever. Get the fuck out of my town. And I don't know if you were here. You leave a smell. Force anyone into therapy. What are your thoughts, Tammy, about maybe coming back to see me? Doesn't she, um, not have a choice? I don't want to force anybody into therapy, but they're forcing her into therapy, so. I also agree that, like, therapy's only going to work if you want to do it. But they're making her do this for the weight loss surgery, right? I feel like, obviously, therapy is hard to convince somebody who's this stubborn. Okay. Okay, okay. I'm not sensing a lot of motivation or commitment on your part. What are your thoughts as you hear me say that? <laughs> she looked at the therapist like, why are you telling me the things that you hear and think? Keep that to yourself! Don't be straight up with me. What the fuck? This is really showing me how much people lie in regular conversation. You know how many times I wanted to be like, I'm really feeling that you're a bitch. Because as I was listening to you and kind of watching you, um, I wasn't getting a lot of information from you. As our session progressed- It takes a while for me to open up. Exactly, and I was just gonna say, as our session progressed, you did open up a little bit. I think underneath all of this stuff, I- <laughs> Underneath all of this stuff you have there? Is that still considered fat or is that like a second person? Could we farm you? I think there's uh, somebody who's really hurt. That's just, that's just my, my impression right now. It's true. Oh my God, twins. I feel like that's something you would explore with the therapist. I just want to leave it alone. Okay, they have you on camera and stuff. Uh, she looks like she's about to take her last breath. Like this is how people act in movies when they're just about to die. They have like one last thing to say. Cancel my OnlyFans subscriptions. So, can you talk to me a little bit more about this food addiction? Tammy is shut down. I think she has a lot of things that she wants to say, but she is finding it hard to trust somebody to share some of her deep secrets with. Yeah, 
And I'm going to be real with you. It's fucking annoying to watch. I would hate to be this therapist. I saw somebody comment saying I would never be a therapist. I don't have the patience for that. I thought that I could be because I do love psychology. Only class I ever got an A in. Do you know how much restraint it would take for me to go, bitch, Jesus Christ. Why is this hard for you? Being honest is easier than what you got yourself into. I'm ready to go home. My first thought was the therapist thinking, oh, okay, that was over in a half an hour, but I'm getting paid for an hour, let's go. That was uh, insufferable. I hate Tammy. Not because of how she looks. If she just wasn't a bitch all the time. Right now my body is telling me that I want a snack, but I'm like, I cannot consume calories after this. I'm shocked that she got the surgery, to be honest. Like, after seeing this, I have zero faith in her, even though I'm living with hindsight right now. I know it worked. I, I can't, how? Like, I've never really seen her have a conversation. I think she might struggle with that because of the breathing. You know, like when you wear a weighted blanket, everything's a little bit harder to do when you move. She's wearing a thousand weighted blankets. Comment down below what you guys think. Should that therapist have hit her? Should they start treating her like an animal with like a spray bottle? I don't know how much that therapist is getting paid, but God damn it should be more. That was like sitting in a room with a grizzly bear. Except grizzly bears way less. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching and listening everywhere. I appreciate you so much. Yo, did you know I do stand-up comedy and post every single set on my second channel, youtube.com slash Markarski? I have a series called The Comedian that documents me doing open mics to the fucking top. Like, I show the entire set, then I podcast breaking down how the set went. Like, I don't think anybody's ever documented an entire stand-up career before, and I think people might be interested, like, what goes on behind the scenes of stand-up comedy. Right now, we're super backlogged. Like, I think we're just getting into April. I'm trying to get back to posting multiple of them a week. We'll see. But I think people might be interested like what goes on behind the scenes of stand-up comedy. So if you want to see some shit like that, youtube.com slash Markarski. If you can't or don't want to, I totally understand. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Let's keep that algorithm going, baby. I fucking love you guys. Mwah.